pretty tragic case. It was an individual who had been hired by this farmer through a temp agency uh, that had sent our client to work on the farm uh, in order to do the irrigation work and some of, some of the other stuff. Now, the farm owner who hired this guy never made sure as to whether the temp agency has any workers' comp insurance or not. So, And there were some issues with regards to safety, um, guidelines with the particular irrigation machine that he was using. But our contention was that this irrigation machine was faulty and that it would basically, the chain would fall out. And the way these irrigation machines, or this one that had worked, it was an old one, is that it had a forward, neutral, and back uh, button uh, or lever that you can use. And in our case, our client said that the he was driving it, chain falls off, puts it in neutral, gets out, and attempts to put the chain back on. And as soon as the chain got back on, our contention was that this particular irrigation machine was defective and improperly maintained by the farmer and that it would kick, kick it into gear forward. So as soon as our client put this chain on, this thing automatically on its own, even though he had set it on neutral, kicked into gear. And unfortunately, as a result of it, it, it amputated his thumb. It amputated his middle uh, pinky finger and part of his uh, ring finger. So basically, our client was ended up with two full fingers and a partial ring finger. And I I'm sure you could imagine. I've done. The, I've talked about this case before and other stuff. Is that you're limited to being able to hold a cup like this. You know, one one of my colleagues who's in the business who does mediation has said, look. What, one of the things that separates us from the animal kingdom is our thumb, you know. If you have your thumb, you can hold a cup like that. Or if you're trying to hold your grip something, you know, that's how you can grip. If you don't have your thumb, then that's how you're gripping. And a lot of times, your grip strength is because of the thumb, which is able to hold underneath whatever you're trying to grip. And so the farmer, of course, said, no. I didn't do anything wrong. There's nothing wrong with the machine. The machine was properly uh, working. What he did is something that is his own fault, that he didn't put it into neutral, and the chain fell off. He forgot to put it back in neutral. It was already in gear, so as soon as he put it back on, the machine started going off. Uh, we established that to some degree, agree. he did agree that, yes, at times the machine would engage itself even though it was on neutral uh, because there have been other employees that had worked at his farm and had commented or complained about that. So that's how we were able to get a recovery for our client.